I have access to all your photos. I can steal your identity. I can become you. Is this your place? No, my mum's out. That's where I grew up, basically. I remember going on forums and getting into modding. Some of the users were like messing about with malware. These guys were bragging, saying they were making like five grand a week, which is crap. I got me interested. That's basically how I started. So I bet you thought this was going to look like something out of Mr. Robot. It's just a map book. Let's say I'm you and I think I know what I'm doing. I don't download nothing, I don't go on no stupid websites. You're sitting there and it's a weeknight and you want to watch your favourite series. So you go on some random website, click a link, and there you go, there's your show. Nothing out of the ordinary happens. But what you didn't know is that the website that you went on allows users to submit links. And the link that you just clicked on was mine. So you just let me in. When you click the link, you authorise the download. I ain't telling you what kit I use or where I get it. But basically, when it goes on your laptop, your stuff becomes my stuff. I can do what I want. I can record your screen, capture email addresses, bank details. I have access to all your photos, your darkest Facebook messages. I can steal your identity. I can become you. Now just make up some fake social media profiles, bank accounts. I'll make you say and do things you'd never do. You just got owned. So the only thing you can do is update, update and update again. Your software and apps, they ask you to update them all the time, usually to fix bugs. They're also meant to fix weaknesses, which people like me can use to attack your device and access all your private data. If you don't update your software and your apps, the weaknesses, they don't get fixed. So you're in a race to update before the hackers get you. People think they're safe, but they just don't have a clue. This is happening countless times every day. I'm one of thousands 